Mr. Carter. Open Hurricane Carter at you. Mm. I'm sorry, you look like your pictures. I thought you'd be bigger. Yeah, I'm bigger than you. But don't tell anybody, okay? Uh, all right. <laughs> hey, this is some place, man. For a human being, don't have to get used to a place like this, but got a lot of guts, kid. Takes a lot of courage to come all the way down there by yourself. If I'm impressed. I'm scared you weren't gonna let me come. Mm, me too. Aren't you whooping Hurricane Carter? What would you be scared of? Mm. Doors opening, the light outside. Of you. Call on the stand. Don't call me Mr. Carter. Call me Rube. Rube? Mm. Rube. All right. Rube. So, tell me about these folks you live with. Oh, the Canadians? Yes. Yeah, I got pictures of them. Yeah. yeah. This is Sam, this is Terry, and this is Lisa. They're the greatest, man. Huh. Yeah, I met him at EPA in Brooklyn, and you know they was doing business. They brought me home and stuff, and the rest is what happened, man. Yeah, that's when my life changed, bro. Huh. Just yanked the brother up and took him up to Canada, just like that. No, no, that's my folks. Nice. So what they do? Are they a religious group or uh, hippies or commune? No, they fix up houses and sell them. You know, they're just people. Just people, just working, eating, living together. I don't know. This is what they do, man. That's their thing. What'd your folks say? Oh, my dad, you know, he's happy. He's glad for me. Oh, okay. He's saying much of people, you fuck. Yeah, but sometimes it's hard, though. Well, yeah, it's hard. You give them hope. Yeah, I guess. You do. You give them hope because you have transcended, Lesbra. It is very important to transcend the places that hold us. You know that? You've learned to read. You've learned to write. Writing is it's magic. You feel that sometimes? Yeah, I guess I do. Mm -hmm. When I started writing, Discovered that I was doing more than just telling a story. See, writing is a weapon. And it's more powerful than a fist can ever be. Every time I sat down to write, I could rise above the walls of this prison. I could look out over the walls all across the state of New Jersey. And I could see Nelson Mandela in his cell writing his book. I could see Huey. I could see Dostoevsky. I could see Victor Hugo, Emil Zola, <laughs> And they would say to me, bro, what you doing in there? And I say, hey, I know all you guys. It's magic, Les. Mm, they sure don't teach that way up in Canada. Maybe you could tell me some books to read. I can do that. But these people in Canada or anywhere else, they can only teach you so much. It's up to you. It's your search. You got to find out what's true for you, what is true for Les Martin. before you think I killed those people son no no I know you didn't how you know I just know Visits up. Everybody out. Come on, folks, let's go. You like a quick picture of you and your son, Mr. Carter? Come on, folks, let's go. It's up to my son. Yeah, all right.